Welcome back everybody, my name is Blau Creation and today we are going to take a look at this flash and hidden slime block launcher. When we sprint over the pressure plate like this and align us with the wall and we are going to be um, launched up and we can go forward onto the wall. Now you can see the redstone. First, we are going to place in the slime block and the pistons. So go underneath the wall in the middle and place a slime block. Then go a, a few blocks down and place directly under the slime block a piston facing up. You have to uh, sometimes remove the ceiling like this. Then we have to go up. Um, and place next to that piston we have to place a uh, normal pistons like this facing up again that are going to um, place the blocks in, uh, there where they have to be at the end so cover it up again like this and now we just have to place a sticky piston here and that is it for the uh, piston placement. Now we have to build the circuit to power the pistons. So go underneath the slime block uh, with a uh, sticky piston, build a block and now build a repeater facing out of that towards the path. Uh, set it on four ticks. Then build a block with redstone on top that is going to uh, power this piston. Then go out on both sides like this. Three, uh, three redstone and block the redstone connection. Then place on either side a normal repeater and place a block with redstone on top. That is going to activate the uh, three other pistons. Power the last piston. We're going to go out from the block underneath the slam block and place a repeater on three ticks into that block uh, and a repeater on one tick facing into the three tick repeater. Behind that we are going to build a non-stable circuit so place a sticky piston, a block and a block next to that with redstone on top. This is going to create a non-stable circuit. Then place a block above that, a redstone torch and uh, place a, um, another block with redstone on top that is going to activate this repeater. Now we have to connect it up to a, um, to a input. So this is going to be the input block. I have now connected the circuits to a pressure plate. The, uh, the distance has to be three and the repeater has to be on four ticks like this then we can try it out so hop on and it should work a, a side note uh, it can go um, above above the um, block that i placed so can go higher than five blocks it can even go five and a half blocks so this works, but this doesn't work. Wait a second. That doesn't work. I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope to see you next time.